Okay, today we're going to talk about uh, installing a vinyl window instead of two windows for a mobile home. So we're going to go from these two windows here, which is two separate windows, to one single window, which gets attached from the outside, and this seal here gets finished off. In order to do that, we need to remove this storm window, which we've done here on this one, and we remove that, so the screws and nails sometimes. Um, take those out, and then you can pry that off from the inside. And then we're left with this on the inside, which if we look a little closer here, we can see that that's just kind of some rough wood that they've put on, and they've shimmed it and all those kinds of things. So same kind of with a with a door, it's just you want to get to the stud measurement, but they've shimmed these off so you can't really get a, a, a really great idea on the exact size of this frame. So we can see that if we were to measure here, we'd be off on our measurement about half an inch. Sometimes there's even three or four of those little pieces right there that really shims this out. So what we're going to do is we're going to remove all of this wood, get down to the bare wood, but in order for measuring, you're going to want to measure kind of with the idea that you're measuring to the stud behind this and then over to here and then of course same with the top and the bottom so all of that comes off okay okay so we've gotten the inside pieces off we've got them all laying here in the floor along with all their shim pieces so they've put this little thin board in there in order to uh you know cover up that window seal to make it look like it's a finished edge there so we need to get that off and we can see here that if we were going to measure this um, with that on there how much uh, we would be off a little bit so um, there's a big gap on the side so what we really need is that measurement from stud to stud there of course and then uh, the, the plate there to the to the header up here so okay so now we just need to get the outside window off um, which we just go outside take all the screws off and pry it out from the outside okay so we got the outside window on it's a double paned low E a vinyl window so it's a insulated glass window um, so we're only going to need that outside one no longer the inside storm window for this so we're just going to need to finish that uh, seal off there and uh, we can look at doing that here but what we're going to need to know is we're going to need to know the thickness of that uh, that wall there so it looks like for this one we're going to need to know that really really precise so see we're at three inches we're going to want to take that a couple spots See, so we're right at three inches. Okay, so do you see right at three inches? Okay, so that's gonna be our measurement. Okay, so we're outside here now. We're going to do some cutting. We got the windows installed outside. We took a measurement inside, which is three inches. So we got ourselves all set up here. Looks like we got ourselves some snow the last few days here. So anyway, so we're all set up with a chop saw. We got a table saw here. And so we're going to uh, shim down some material. We got our fence set at uh, three inches. So we're ready to go on that. And then we'll, uh, we'll cut to fit and uh, go over that here in a few minutes. Okay, so we didn't really go over some of the materials that we were using for uh, the inside window seal that we were cutting down to three inches there. What I really like to use is I like to use laminate flooring. So that snap together flooring. Um, and so we can get it in a variety of different colors, um, light browns and grays and all kinds of different things. And it seems to cut real well um, at a one piece. You know, we had three inches on this job, which is not all the time. It's not three, sometimes it's four sometimes it's three and a quarter sometimes it's two and a half so anyways but we can get uh you know two pieces out of one sheet if you grab a package of that uh, um, before you do a window you can do a few windows just with one of those so um, i don't like to use stuff that you have to paint or that pressed wood stuff or drywall i don't really like using those kinds of things but this laminate flooring seems to hold up real real well um, so that's what i like to use Okay, so we're gonna put uh, the window seal in now. So um, in order to do that, we've cut some strips and we're gonna put those in. And we can see that when we put this one in, it's a little bit small. So you can still see the little, the little gap right there. So what we're gonna do to solve that is, we're just gonna double that up, okay? So see, we double it up and voila, that covers that whole trim piece corner right there like that. And then we're going to trim right here okay okay so we're all finished up here um, looks like we got her all trimmed out and all so basically the finished overall look is something like like that I know it's a little hard to see there but so 
that's basically a finished window there. Okay, and you can see how we we just came in, put the face trim right over top of it, so it kind of does that for us there. You can see how it finishes off there.